All right, guys, welcome to another video of Stop 51 Vending. Um, I guess my videos are about stupid BS stuff, but I figure I'd throw this one in. So there's this company called Upright Law. It's called Upright Law, okay? Now, this is a, I don't know exactly what it is, but I guess it's a network of many, many, and I mean many, thousands and thousands upon thousands of lawyers and attorneys and stuff like that. Anyways, I had a question to ask, so I gave them a call. I made an account, and uh, apparently in order to speak to an attorney, you must give them a debit card. So they can book the appointment. Now, they're not charging anything off the debit card. Uh, they're just using it as a form of security for some reason. Or when you do have to pay, they're going to use that as payment. Uh, they will not take check or money orders or credit cards. Because uh, these guys are specifically are their, 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 main, their main law is uh, bankruptcy law. Um, so I was just calling about something that I, that I had for many, many years ago and I was just calling to ask a question. So anyways, I got called, I asked a question. I spoke to one guy. He told me exactly what I needed to do. And I said, thank you. That's not what I needed. And hopefully I thought that was it. Now I figured the second person would call and it would be a mistake or by accident because they're and like I didn't know it was a network. I didn't know. I just thought it was I was speaking to one person from one company, you know, that would be just you know one person I was speaking to. Anyways, this was on I guess a Thursday, I guess. Um of last week. We are now a Friday. We are on April 22nd, 2022. So I guess about a week ago. So that was what, seven days ago, uh, eight days ago. So you're talking about uh, 22. So it must have been on the 14th. On the 14th of April, I gave them a call. I kid you not, since that freaking day, my phone has not stopped ringing, okay? It has not stopped ringing. So I figured, all right, one call is a mistake, two calls is a glitch, three calls they haven't gotten to the system yet, four calls they're kind of like working through it to get my number out of it. But I kid you not, must be uh, uh, maybe 200 plus calls. And, you know, at some point you would think that it's a mistake, it's an accident or whatever it is. Um, but now it's becoming like a harassment thing. Like I told the first person, thank you for your services. I got what I needed and I no longer need your services. So after about, I say three or four days, I got an email saying that your service has been canceled. I said, it's freaking great. Because originally I made it, they told me to download an app and to do the whole thing. And I was like, great. So apparently they said that my, my, my service was deleted or whatever it was. Anyways, that was on a Sunday. Today is Friday again. As of Monday morning at 8 o'clock on the dot. I kid you not. Hi, this is an attorney from Upright Law. Are you still interested in getting your bankruptcy taken care of? I said, uh, and I've been saying it to the ones before that. I said, look, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry. But, you know, the other 99 people that called before you. I explained them the same thing that I'm explaining to you right now, that I no longer need your service because at this point, I feel like I'm being harassed by your service because, you, you know, if somebody calls you once, twice, three times, all right, I give you 10 times, or right? I give you 10 times until it's like, yo, forget it, done, over with, you know, like leave it alone. But 
I can show you my block list, and every time it's a 309 number, you know, and, and sometimes they won't even answer because it's an automated system calling for them. And then when the automated system feels like, like it had, like the person had picked up the phone, then the, the person will get on. But I'm like, come on, guys. I mean, now this is getting to harassment. Uh, this is crazy. And every hour, every hour, I get a phone call and I have to block it. I literally stepped out of my car for five minutes. I got a call, missed call eight minutes ago. Luckily, that number was already blocked. And I'm just like, you've got to be kidding me. And the worst thing is, I think that they're all called from the same place. I think, I think, I think the computer is routing it from the same number. And, and, and like 90% of them were from different numbers, but the other 10% were from the same number. I have a feeling that's why my phone blocked at this time. But I mean, come on, guys. Upright law. You should know the law of harassment. Um, if these calls don't stop, okay, it has been eight days since I officially signed up with you guys, and it has been about four days since I officially, how do you say it, unsigned it or canceled your service, and I got an email saying that you had canceled my service. Why am I still receiving phone calls? Why? Why am I still receiving phone calls that I, I specifically signed up to not receive? So, guys, if you're watching this video and you get in contact with Upright Law, it's called Upright Law. They're bankruptcy lawyers, okay? They're debt lawyers. Um, <laughs> I mean, look, if, if, if I said my service, if, if I said your services wasn't good enough for me and I can't afford it, right, or it's not for me, then why would you continue to call me? You know, and I give you the 10 times that 10 people mysteriously called me because the system is dialing me. But come on, you know, over 200 numbers already. Come on. This has got to be getting, you know, this has got to get a little more, bit more serious because now you guys are like, like joking around now, you know, and I just, and now you're wasting your time and my time when you could be calling somebody else because this is called hard calling. You know, yes, I signed up. I 110% agree with you. I signed up. I gave you my credit card. I agree with you 110%. But then I also replied to the first person that I spoke to. Thank you. Your services are no longer needed. To the first person that I spoke to. Okay. Why am I still receiving phone calls? And then after I got the cancellation email... I'm still receiving phone calls. So, I mean, look, I don't know how good your service is. If, if, you're, if you're that hungry for someone that doesn't need the service, you know, then I don't know. I don't know how, 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 how you guys are making any money with this or how you guys profiting or even surviving because you'd probably have a shitload of lawsuits against you just for harassment. Okay. And, you know, calling my business line 24-7 nonstop is harassment. All right. So once again, guys, upright law. No, I'm not going to type it over there. I will leave a link in down below. And if you guys want to watch it, watch it. I really don't care. If you want to visit them, visit them. Don't give them your information. Learn the easy way. Don't learn the hard way like me. All right. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching my stupid video, and um, have a great day. Have a great weekend. Peace out. Buy a gumball or something. Buy candy. Eat a candy. Give your kids candy. Give your kids gumball or something. I don't know. Something. Don't just sit here and watch my video. Stupid.